That's another one down. Now there's one there is one over here, but that one does not unlock until you beat in the post game. Yeah. Kind of a, a annoying. Some uh yeah, some uh, some challenges do not open until you actually beat the game. Which is odd. And only open sometimes only when an actual power up you have evolved two. Kind of annoying anyway. While well, we conquered one road, let's conquer another one and see how it fares with this one. Conquer the Infernal Road. All right. I will take that, thank you. Bonesaw Kirby! I think one of the challenges in here is actually defeat the enemy with Crash. And there is a Crash Bomb in this level, so... Need to look out for that one if I see fit. I think I have to defeat a boss with it. Hey! Got my Buzzsaw! I'll buzzsaw the cannon to death. Come on, person hammers. Yeah, this level is mostly a vertical level. So we have to watch out for all the nice vertical verticality this level contains. Got some cash on hand, some secrets as well, so it's not like it's a completely linear level. Take your, hey, they have a snake guy, I'll buzz you to death. That's what you get for trying to eat me. Oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, is there anything down here? I don't see anything down there. But sometimes, you know, the game can technically hide stuff on the on the walls, even as you know it might not be something there. Like that, or like well, that's a little behind. That's a little... I want to say there was supposed to be a crash guy right here, but I don't think it spawned. Unless it spawns after the fact. I don't know. We'll see. Ladder right here. Get ourselves a waddle dee. Conquering this infernal road one one buzz saw at a time. Back here, maybe it's upper up on top of the level. I have to find the crash guy. It could be right there. There's crash, but I don't want to use the power up right now. Okay, there is something over there, but I don't think I'm high enough to do it. Yeah, it's right here. Up right here. Yeah, it's, there's like a secret here. Again, I'm trying not to use the ability because it'll destroy itself after one use. That's what the crash ability does. Because right there is a challenge. Steal two meals. You have to do that here. Now. Booyah! Boomyah! Just crash the feet of Wild Frosty. Do, 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 do. Boom, yeah. I'll take your power up. Thank you. Thank you. Zoom. Not bad. Find the Frosty to, you know, go back in time. <laughs> but now we have to actually have to use Frosty for its actual purpose, too. Now, the game does did tell you this earlier that you uh, that uh, the Ice Kirby can actually walk or actually ice skate over lava. But it's like, why would they tell you this if there wasn't, you know, a technically a lava-based level going on going forward? Well, now this is the reason why behind it. Now we actually freeze now lava rocks above us and we get that waddle for our troubles. Second one in the line. More coins to boot. Switch down like so and we get ourselves out of here. Freeze these guys away. Get out of here. Freeze you. I don't need you around here. Eh. Up down here for our capsule of the day. Capsules! Mark, we don't die on me now. <laughs> I'm gonna ride up this way. And uh, we get ourselves the destruction of the land or something. Oh, no! Something out here? There's, always, there's a platform up here. Why there wouldn't be? There's something up here. Oh, no, Kirby! Why'd you slide off, Kirby? It's not like I'm technically on ice for some reason. <laughs> Little friction, what's that? <laughs> Here we got some energy. Kirby! Oh, you. Ice Kirby again is not one of my favorite power ups just because of the slipperiness this thing has. Want to take this down and want to grab the mouthful ability? 
And then quickly get yourselves back because I'm pretty sure there's gonna be those bad things right there. No, Kirby! Am I gonna cross now? Ooh! Ugh, man, that's a rough. This is actually a, a, a missed opportunity. If you miss that, that's a uh, that's a loss. You wouldn't be able to get access to this room right here. Oh, I thought the game kind of froze there for a second. I kind of got kind of scared there. Oh, we got time abilities here. Get a mouthful of this guy. Open him up. Now we hit the switch. We need to get over here. Open up this thing. Pull it down, pull it down. Oh, top it over, top it over, Kirby. Come on. There we go. We're gonna get up here. Roll this thing around. We got this. We can get this wall deep. Yeah, there we go. Woo! That's close. We're speedy Kirby of mouthful abilities. Not enough to give you a teleporter for some reason. I don't have no idea why. The room's not that big. Oddly enough. All right, let's continue on. This, let's continue on with the level. Wow, he actually this he can actually harm the the. That can harm the. Oh wait, I think I did not. I think I did that wrong. I think I have to go up somewhere higher and come back down. Yeah, the jump up here, then go down. There he is, that Waldy for us. Thank you. Need all the Waldies I can get anyway. <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. What's this light thing? What do you do here? Oh, we got coins. Oh, I definitely need them. <laughs> Kirby, you're always broke. Boyo! Ah, uh, you say that excuse for everything. Even I can't even translate that. <laughs> I really want to know, man, why would you want to build a... That's one of the one things that... Why would you want to build a, a city next to an active volcano? Though I actively look at, you know, Hawaii and everything, but still... Oh, I need Ranger. I need Ranger Kirby for this! Come on, Ranger Kirby! Ranger Kirby! Take these cannons away from us. Get out of here. Stop ruining my fun. Now I can actually walk around with no problem. I think there's actually like a target we need to hit. That's just like right out, just right out of range here. We'll get the mouthful ability. I don't need to activate that for the sign though. But I just do. So it's kind of weird how like some places people like they build cities and they live like right next to dangerous areas. Like they know that it's dangerous, but they'll do it anyway for the sake of you know it's a nice place to live for the most part until the until the volcano goes active again. I won't. I will make sure you won't die to lava. You'll die to air, like you. Air. Uh, uh. I hear you. These wolfies out of here. I believe there is a secret passage of sorts or a secret area that requires you to use Ranger Kirby? You say? I think it's over here. Now I think there is actually is a skip to this level if you if you're a speedrunner and whatnot. And if you can float high enough and actually glide across, you can actually avoid this entire sector altogether. But that means you miss out on a... Oops. I actually... I think it was a... Target. I think it's, I think it's after this area, I think. We jump down. And I, I question Sunshine for this, but still also now Kirby does it too. For now, we have a lava-proof uh, boat, apparently. I don't know how this works, but you know what? It's Kirby. I'm not going to question it. That's our last wall of D to be saved out of a chest. Nice. Though, to be fair, we've already unlocked everything the uh, the hub world has to offer right now. So there's just no more. There's no more new buildings to unlock. No nothing. It's just more of saving all the wall of D's to have you know 100% completion now at this moment, and then also taking on the boss this area too. Because this is like this is the last world that actually requires you to actually you know grab you know all of these enough all these to actually you know beat the world you know. So it's kind of awkward at the same time, but still you have to save the all these from danger. Oh, there's our target. That's something I was wondering about. Before. 
And I missed. How did I miss? There we go. That brings us a blueprint. You got the Space Ranger blueprint. Now you can make the Ranger ability. Evolve it. And it has a pretty beefy power. Not going to lie, folks. That's another level done and dusted for us. Ha, da, da, da. Hey! More stages, more fun, more everything. What did I miss? I, the I did. I missed one windmill. Where did I miss one? <laughs> Weird. Uh, Gabon. Again, no repeats yet. Wow, no repeats. I'm shocked by this. I'm going to look at the collection at the end of the playthrough and see what if it actually can reframe that claim or not. Right? That's not a level force right there. The brain turning power plant. Let's go do it. With more. <laughs> more hours to go. Hey, right, let's go do those first. Huzzah! Okay, let's see about this. Oh, that one. That one is locked. We don't have the wild hammer ability. We don't have enough coins to even upgrade the thing in the first place. But we have twin drill we can activate, though. Let's see about twin drill and let's do this bad boy proper. Dig and duck runaway parade. The prize is not in Wondria for whatever reason. It's in this level specifically. Gotta watch out for the parade and it's all its dangers. Twin Drill Kirby is just more of just more damage output, I think, from Kirby. Because you have like these missiles you can like this offshoot ability you can get with them. Not really useful because again, Kirby is more of a close range fighter than an actual ranged attacker. So that's one of the things I like to think about, you know, you know, Ranger Kirby as well as, you know, Buzzsaw Kirby now. Is like well, at least Ranger Kirby. I'm, I'm hoping there's going to be more projectile weapons for Kirby in the future. Because, again, Ranger Kirby just shows that, yes, even Kirby can have can hold a gun. Oh, that's also with the twin uh, twin saw blade here. It's also that it um actually has a drill saw, has a, a drill blade on the top of it. So now you can actually damage enemies while you're drilling. Yeah, kind of a nice bonus. No lie. We're in wild mode. We are still 300 coins away from upgrading the wild hammer. <laughs> so we're gonna have to go back to that one after they do this next level and whatnot. Maybe get enough coins, we can actually unlock it. All right, let's see what the la this next level is. The burning, churning power plant. This one actually does have a howl room in it. Believe it or not. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of a, out of the way. Kind of weird in that regard, but it's like, um, <laughs> like you have to, you, know, you have to go and like find the computer room, technically. And then you have to go and walk on top of like this pillar that's up there on the top right. Walking all the way up in there, and there's a howl room. But that means you have to walk all the way back here just to get, just to unlock it. But we have now the mechanical factory level. I'm not too big of a fan of this place, really, to be honestly. Just did a lot of crushers. He had a lot of quick platforming skills. At least running anyway. Also, I want to upgrade the ranger ability to the to the space ranger. I really want to, but I can't. I don't have the coins. <laughs> Maybe I'll have to play. Um, I guess I should just grind off screen. Just a lot of um. Shall we say you know the uh, the was it the um, Meta Knight course? Just grind those to get like you no know, thousand coins, thousand coins each time. Recover this. That's a lot. You want to jump on top of this guy though. Oh boy. Can I get up here? No. Oh, I can get up here. That door. Oh, it's all. Oh, no, it's further back. That's right. Yeah, yeah, Wolfies. Open the door. Open the door. We need to get this. We need to break the box here. There we go. Now we can get on top. This is the little secret area. You get on top of here, and you see this little open passage here. You come into here, and 
you see a infiltrate the control room. And it gets another, uh, I guess it's a capsule. I want to say just act just being here actively activates the door. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Yeah. I think just coming in here just activates the door that goes to the howl room. Um, I'm gonna check that out real quick, actually, since we can actually go back outdoors. This is like one of the rare times. You just got to, you know, watch out for the the walls here. Watch out for the walls to collapse on itself and get the secret howl room. Let's see what this room in contains. Kirby, goodness me, <laughs> Kirby, <laughs> Kirby, you're gonna get flattened right back at you there. I'll tell you. No, oh, Kirby. Ow! That does a insane amount of damage. <laughs> I forgot how. how... Come on, Kirby, Kirby. Wow, that's really gonna kill me, isn't it? This is my maximum tomato on this one. Trying to get back to this howl room is a little tricky, just because it's just a long. Man, I got crushed through that hole. That's annoying. <laughs> I had to use up my maximum tomato for this. Well, it doesn't hurt. I can go back and get another one, no matter what I do. Come back here. You see these coins? Yeah, coins. Coins we normally should have picked up earlier, but look at this, though. Now we can actually jump on. I can actually get on this uh, little stairs is now here. How odd. Also, I think there's like an invisible wall here, so I don't think you can actually fall off. Clearly we didn't see these ladders here earlier, but hey, you know what? We can get up here, though, into a secret passage. This secret passage is pretty cool. It brings us to a howl room. This is actually my first time actually coming here, actually. <laughs> I actually never got here the first time myself. But you have it, but you have the uh, the howl music, the uh, the Kirby hidden room music and everything. Ow, I keep... I don't know if I'm not getting hurt by the boxes, even though I'm clearly getting hit by it. We also have Drill and Ranger Kirby in here. Interesting. Putting all the boxes away, though, activates mouthful mode. But I'm going to grab... Ooh, the time... Is a time crash here? Wow, that's a shock. I don't know where you would use one use time crash for. There's that, but this is the Howl room for us, folks. You have to break the Howl name. And probably we're not getting hurt, right? So it's kind of weird. And we get more capsules, more fun, more everything. More money! And food for our trouble. Give my capsule. Thank you! Booyah! Nice. We can't take this ability anywhere. We can't take the mouth mode away from us. We must venture forth. I can't believe it. Where do we go from here? Is there like a pathway out here somewhere? I can't go any further. Oh, that's out here. That's a door. All right. Kind of confused there for a second. But yeah, that's the howl room for you. Now, I'm not sure if there's another one. Oh, look at it. You can actually get pulled right back to here. That's kind of a nice little neat shortcut. It means you don't have to go through all that crap again. Like... Also, I think all the things are closed now. Yeah, that's interesting. You learn new stuff every day when playing the Kirby games. <laughs> In the dark and dark and mysterious and weirdly secrets of the game itself. All right, we go here. We got Wolfies. A coffee. Or, or uh, pick up three cups of coffee. It is actually coffee. Okay. I just don't want to get, you know, flattened by these things again. The thing already did a ton of damage towards me. Which, to be fair, you can go and get the double health uh, from the shop, and I wouldn't, and I wouldn't bat an eye because double health is just fun in general. Like I said, you can get the, uh, you can play this in gentle breeze mode, which is only just doubles your health normally. At least it extends your whole life meter a little bit, but still, the fact. And then you can also get the double life on top of that, and you have a Kirby that technically has a lot of health and you can't die, Bree. Really. So maybe you want to use that if you want to go after secrets, maybe. Ow! Hey! Actually, you know what? I actually do want this. Come on! Fire Kirby! Fire Dragon Kirby! Come on, conveyor belts. Woo! Ow. Stupid cannons! <laughs> Stop hitting me! <laughs> Don't need to be hit! Oh, well, we got the, uh, there's a capsule I want. No. Ooh! 
Ugh. There we go, Kirby. Is there a switch here? There's a switch here that needs fire. That <laughs> makes the uh, machinery go back to work. Yay! Nice. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's go, Kirby! And a baby bottle? Okay, Kirby, you can take the water. You can take the baby bottle. <laughs> but where's the baby? That's all questions of the Kirby lore. <laughs> the baby bottle and everything else. Oh, yes. Here we go. We don't have... Ooh, okay, this is going to be funny. This is going to be tricky. Need to activate this, I think. Oh, we have to... Oh. oh. Okay. We need to move this out of the way. We need to move this out of the fuse's way. So. Oh no. I oh I got in the way of it. Now oh, that's so stupid. At least it has regrowing. It's a regrowing fuse. At least. Goodness. Ah. <laughs> They're in the problem right here. That's for sure. Gotta get around here. Here we go. Kirby, you jump, jump, Kirby, jump! Get in that cannon, Kirby! Ooh, boy. There we go. Woo! That's rough. Ah! Secret passage and money. But also, indeed, a Waddle Dee. Ha ha ha! Thank you, Waddle Dees. We're good to go on this one. Let's go. Now we're back out here. Oh, whoa, 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 Kirby. You don't need to drop down that quickly. There is a blueprint right there. Get that blueprint. It's coming. I must get it. The deep sleep blueprint. Yeah, I can evolve the sleep ability. Why? I don't know why. Uh, the deep sleep ability allows you to actually sleep on command instead of just, you know, after you grab it once. Which again is nice, but again. Do you really want to use the sleep ability? Probably not, but still. They made a blueprint for it to make it sort of useful. It's almost like Crash. It's almost like a healing version for the Crash ability. Oh boy, we gotta get out of here. There's a cup of coffee. Grab it. That sleeping ability, that, that sleeper definitely needs a coffee for his wake up call. The wake up call is gonna be a, dun -dun -dun, a crusher with his name on it. Give him my capsule! Need the mouthful ability. Ooh! There we go! Oh, I don't. Uh, uh, folks, I. I don't. I, I, I'm not. Again, for folks, I get it for my YouTube recording streams. I usually just. Like, if it's. A, if there's something about the game that. about it, I'll. I'll comment with chatting and everything. But at the same time, though, I'm glad you guys are enjoying the, uh, the stream regardless. You got a head? All right. No worries, though. Oh, boy. Got myself out of that dangerous situation there. No problem. All right. What we got here, Kirby? Put your cans to good use. Blow up those rocks. Oh, we got to do the hole in the wall. <laughs> Kirby's hole in the wall game. This level is actually quite long, in fact. Oh, no. Need it. Oh boy, no, Kirby, what why is it a why is it a corner? Why is it a triangle? At least I'm able to keep the mouthful ability, but still, it's like why is it a triangle? Shouldn't I why is it not a circle? Oh yeah. Get that the wrong one. There we go. Leaving a mouthful ability can basically harm you. That's kinda of shocking. Also, breaking the ground! Baldi! Oh no, yes. Huzzah! The money! I have enough money to evolve an ability, which I will definitely do. Let's go, let's get out of here. Give me my Waddle Dees, we're out of here. Hey! Good stage. Invade the control room. Missed a coffee and we did and we got squished, unfortunately, so we don't get that 
Well, these kind of our worst uh, of uh, worst abilities we've had for Kirby nowadays. We have the scissor lift mouth Kirby. New new figurines. Odd. Kirby gained the mysterious mouth muff through the vortex. Now you can stuff an entire scissor lift into his mouth. Raise and lower yourself to reach items and dodge enemy attacks. You can also spit out the lift when you're done. We got Needle Kirby. That's still new. Pointy, spin, speak, spiky, clutter, and roll up into a ball. It's needles upon needles. What a powerful weapon. Roll forward and release and send out clutter of uh, cl sharp clutter flying all around you. Ouch. We got here. Scissor lift. Again, these are all new figurines. We haven't got a repeat yet. Wow. Docked. There's Bernard. Uh, this is up at your pup as an ex expert marksman. Pew pew. Who's quick on his feet as he patrols the new world? His eyes are hidden under his hat. But that doesn't stop him from affect his aim. He also has an impressive sniffer that can track prey near and far. I didn't think it was actually a dog in the first place, too. 